Another week, another Walking Dead episode. It's crazy that we're on episode 20 already, because these past few weeks have gone very, very quickly. It's a bit like WandaVision. That's, that started and then ended very quickly, it seemed. Last episode was the Gabriel and Aaron episode, and it was pretty good. It's tricky to say what is the best episode so far in these extra six, but I, I think the Gabriel and Aaron one might might be at the top for me at the moment just I did really like the um Carol and Daryl episode as well one thing I noticed as well is that in every episode there's been a certain scene where it's kind of slowed stuff down and been a bit of a sad scene I guess because there was that scene in episode 17 with Daryl and Maggie when they when they were in the containers then Episode 18, there was that scene with Leah and Daryl, but also at the end there was the scene with Carol and Daryl. And then in episode 19, there was that scene with Gabriel where he was trying to explain um, about that priest and his past and stuff. So I'm wondering if there'll be a similar scene in this one. I think that's about it. Um, I'll press play and see what we get. Oh, and don't forget to subscribe as well if you haven't already. If you think that you have, then just go and double check. You might not be because there's about 60% of you that watch the, these vids that aren't subscribed. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm wondering if they are going to say that Dwayne Morgan's son is at Commonwealth because that, that guy looks very similar to how Dwayne probably would look at this point in time. I, I know a lot of people have thought that as well, but I was thinking that when they showed it in, when they showed him in the trailer. What's she gonna do? Well, that went well, didn't it? Ooh. That's a GG. I don't see how the Commonwealth can be good in any way. Ooh. I'm guessing she's gonna try and escape. I don't think that's gonna work. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco. You can count. Yay. Albany, Annapoli, Atlanta, Augusta, Austin, Baton Rouge, Bismarck, Boise. Yeah, I have no idea what you're saying. I don't know how they're going to get out of this. I'm assuming everyone else is also in, like, train cart things. Gonna end up with a splinter. <laughs> I told you. At least let me go get them. <laughs> How is that? A bang on the door, scream really loud, get them over here so we can talk to them. That's probably not going to work. It's a terrible idea. <laughs> I have to do something. Sorry. I feel really sorry for her because she's like really trying to do stuff. It's dark in here. You Nico. She's like a lost puppy. <laughs> Listen to me. Listen to my voice, okay? I'm gonna try to get in there to help you. No, just keep talking to me, okay? Okay. So when it's I was like she's gonna die or something. I was in a similar spot. I had to stay home from school, which sucked. Hmm. Yeah. Weird. I know. This one girl taught me how to dye my hair, which totally changed my life. Hmm. <laughs> I wonder where she is now. Probably dead. If you made it. Probably not. <laughs> Yumiko. You still with me? She's just having a nap. <laughs> anyway, uh, I nagged my mom. And she sent me back to school before my hand healed. Swelled up like a birthday balloon. Like oozing this gross pus that made me feel like yeah. a swamp monster. And my mom didn't seem to notice. I said, well, wait, man. You can't push me away. This was my house first. It, this is turning very dark. He smacked me hard. This is turning very dark. Across my 
Y yo, Miko. So my mom said, then don't eat. Bruh. Uh, I didn't know where that story was going when I started. Hey, wake up! Yumiko! Hey, Yumiko! I'm pretty sure she's not gonna die. Come on, answer me! I think. Wake I hope. Up. Yumiko! Hey! Answer me! Shut up! Bruh. I hate the Commonwealth. <laughs> I thought I would like the Commonwealth, but they're all idiots. Where's Ezekiel in all of this? Is he just like further away? Same with Eugene. Is it seriously just that easy? <laughs> well, they didn't think that through properly when they put her in there. <laughs> Stop that. You're coming. <laughs> no, it's not a good idea. Why not? Sorry, man, but that's bad shit. Stop it. <laughs> so is there only just two of them there now? Surely someone would have seen her out and about. And they would have seen her there as well. They caught you the consequences for our acceptance into their community could be disastrous. He just said they were nice. There's no room for miscalculations, you hear me? So she's just gonna go and do stuff anyway. Are they coming in now? Where are we going? Walk. Bro, you could like at least answer. Bro, what, what are they doing? What are you gonna do to me? This is what are you very doing? weird. Turn around. If I got this splinter in my hand that's driving me nuts. Can you maybe take it out? Please. Can't she just take it out? You don't know your name. Princess. You think this is a joke? <laughs> I'll friend of you, the girl. You took her. You're helping her, right? She's getting help now. How old are you? 28, 29. I, I could be 50. I don't know, man. <laughs> like a long time ago. Can you just tell me how she Where are you from? Where were you when the fall happened? <laughs> Why is any of that important? I'm intrigued now. Pittsburgh. She hurt her head pretty bad. You're avoiding the question. She might have a concussion. She's fine. If he could just say you know, if she's all good, then she could answer the questions afterwards. Just like, let me see her. He's being stupid. Tell me about her. I'm hoping that he dies very quickly. What do you want from me? We're done. I gave you answers. Get her out of here. Why can't I see her? What did you do with her? Why can't I see her? Because you're being a bitch. I wanna see her! Bruh. Bruh. You should have answered our questions. You're an idiot, man. Why cut? Oh my god. I hope that all of the Commonwealth aren't this annoying. Because these guards so far, or these soldiers, they're just... They're so stupid. I genuinely hate them. <laughs> oh, are they back again? Oh, no, they're going to Eugene this time. I reckon Eugene's probably going to just answer all of their questions properly. He shouldn't, but he probably will. This seems familiar. Someone on top? Is this Ezekiel? What the? Ezekiel? Yeah, boy. Sorry. Oh, wait. oh man, they got you too. Yeah. Not the most fun interview I've ever had. <laughs> Let's get out of here. Right now. No, next week. Yes, right. You make us hurt. I think they took her to help her. I made it here, didn't I? We'll be fine. Nothing is fine.
dickhead uh, <laughs> nailed me over an old fracture. Oh. What do you see? I'll be okay. It's healed fine every time before. We'll keep watch up top. They really do just keep adding to the pile of making me feel sorry for Princess. We can't just leave them here. You don't think I know that? They're my friends. Fear brings out the worst in them. As he just did in me. I apologize. I just want to do the right thing. I know. We need a better plan. Sounds like they're coming in. This is all just a little scary. You know what I'm saying? Your question, your guns, your whole getup. I mean, we were loving it. was just. <laughs> Now they can use the armor. We really can't help you. How? Let's just say we have access to things that are valuable in times like these. Food, medicine, ponies, what? <laughs> I'm not saying yes, but I'm not saying no. You know what I mean? We're organized. You should let us help you. That's why you came, right? So let's say you're telling the truth, and you're actually very helpful people who like to help, even if you look like a bunch of scary action figures came to life. What happens after this? What are you going to do with us? I don't know. He's lying again. I don't know exactly. You're messing with are us. Are you messing what with us? What would be the point of that? This is not our first time at the rodeo with people like you. People do terrible shit to each other all the time. <laughs> I meant what I said. What we stand for is real. This, all this, is just standard protocol on mission-based assignments. We have paperwork to fill out for Christ's sake. The place we live is a good place. I'm so new that rifle isn't even loaded. Bruh. Is he even able to kill him because he's got like a thing over his neck? Surely he wouldn't be able to do it. Ezekiel's going in! Um Okay. Oh. No one is gonna hurt you anymore. Well that's interesting. Oh. Okay. Princess going in? Bruh. She needs to just push the gun through first. Come on. Ooh, girl. Get your shit together. Don't be so hard on yourself. This is new. I get it. <laughs> Time waits for no one. We start dying the day we're born. <laughs> this is really weird. Go. I'm an old. You're good on your own. I'm a goddamn superhero on my own. So let's go. <laughs> you want to go? Believe me, I know. What if I leave? It makes me just like her, don't it? Yeah. It makes you just like mom. She was a survivor. She was a monster. There are always monsters. She was scared. Everybody gets scared sometimes. You remember what it was like. We had to learn our lessons the hard way. Take your freedom. We were 
there were some good ones, though. Maybe not Mom or Dougie. Not everyone was bad. There was Miss Travis. Sammy and his people. And them. They're the stories you tell yourself. And then there's the truth. Maybe. Even though this episode took a weird turn, I'm still here for it. <laughs> but they came back from me. Still unsure about that guy. Mm. What? Ah. Uh. The splinter came out. Hmm. <laughs> We've been on the road for a week. We had bikes for a while. Then we walked. That's how we got here. Why am I here? To be with them. And their names are Eugene, you, Nicole, and Ezekiel. So you already knew that. And my name is Splinter. That's good. Thank you. So, so when can I see my friends? Right now. I got it, let's go! But is that just so then they can go... No! That's the end? What? I was gonna say, is that just so they, they can... They can go to the Commonwealth? Like, the actual Commonwealth? But... That's the end of the episode? That felt so quick and, like, nothing really happened. Okay. That episode was so weird. I don't know what to think about that episode. I... I... I don't know. <laughs> hmm. What do I say about an episode that focused pretty much on one character the whole time, didn't progress the story at all, apart from a tiny bit, and and then ended abruptly. <laughs> I like the episode, but at the same time, it felt like half an episode. <sighs> yeah, I don't know. <laughs> That's the first one so far where I've just been very confused as to what to say at the end of the episode. <laughs> And the annoying thing is, as well, that it's not going to be explained until the summer, because it's going to be in season 11. Because episode 21 is another Daryl and Carol one, and then episode 22 is the Negan one. I feel like if there was going to be another Commonwealth episode after this, then I'd be okay with it. But because this is the last episode to do with the Commonwealth in season 10, I'd... <laughs> it, it's kind of annoying. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know about this one. I don't know if I'm the only one in that boat as to not being so sure if the episode was a good episode or not. It had good parts to it, but again, it didn't feel like a full episode. It felt like, it just it felt like filler for the most part. I get that we explored Princess's character a lot more and like her past and stuff like that, but the reveal that all along she wasn't actually talking to anyone other than herself felt it, it, it was interesting, but then she went out and talked to Ezekiel that was chilling with some walkers. And that's where I was like, what's going on here? I think in conclusion, it was a good episode. But it could have, it could have been a lot more, I think. Anyway, I think that's about it for this episode. If you agreed or disagreed and want to talk about it in the comments, then you can leave it there and I'll get back to you as quickly as I can. If you liked the video, then thank you. And if you liked the video but haven't actually liked the video yet, there is a like button down there that you can click.
If you wanted to subscribe as well, then that would be much appreciated. You don't have to, but it would, it would help me a lot. And yeah, I guess I'll see you next week for another Walking Dead thing, if that's all that you're here for. If not, then there'll be Falcon and the Winter Soldier at some point. And maybe some gaming stuff. I, I did a whole video to do with a Fortnite thing. And then my editor just... It, it didn't work, it broke. So everything that I'd done just got erased. So I don't even know if I want to go back into that, but I might do. So yeah. See you, fool!